You see, I never sh not shit, cheat on my rules. I always sing my favorite song most of the times, most of the time. Well, hello and welcome back. Thanks for coming back. Downtown Kedipathos on a truly, truly spectacality of a day indeed. All that's missing is you, so why not get yourself on a big bird or a canoe, start paddling like crazy. Now, without further ado, I'm going to introduce you to the most beautiful woman in the world, and her name is Ms. Archie Gracivia Labouf. Hello, everybody. How nice to see you again and again on this beautiful day. If anything, I'll start undressing myself. That's because it's so warm and it's so pleasant. And you know what? Against the prediction of the weather forecast, forecast. <coughs> On that note, <laughs> forecast, yes, forecast. Ah, forecast. You're thinking about Norfolk. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. think I mix up the uh, Norfolk cast. F -f forecast. Forecast. Uh, we are against the rules. We're having a beautiful sunshine and what a warm day. You can't even imagine. I'm telling you, I'm getting heated by this lovely sun. Yeah, she is not heated. She's getting heated. Although, now and again, perhaps we should give her a quick chunk, chunk, chunk. chunk, 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 chunk. A chuck, chuck, chuck. A Jackie Chan. Now, we are at the brand new sunset viewing platform in downtown Keda Pathos. That is the Pathos Castle or Fort. That over yonder is the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. And this is the brand new seating area where you can sit, digest your thoughts, look out for the views, and of course, wait for that sun to set. And one thing's for sure, it really is a spectacularity of a place indeed. That's the pathway, the coastal broadwalk that takes you out to the Kefalios beach area and, of course, the lighthouse beach area. That's the car park to the rear of the harbour. That's Ketapapos Harbour. And guess what? That's where we're going to go. And uh, should we go and stick our... Um, Be stick careful. Looks. Yes, I know our looks, our eyes to this wonderful and beautiful waves that are performing us today uh, in a beautiful way just for a couple Come of on minutes. then, let's go and have a look. Let's take you to the water's edge and show you the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. We're in the third week of February and I tell you what, the sun is glistening upon us. And of course we know that two superstars are going to jet into Patmos very, very soon indeed. If your name's Lady Andrea, and there's a Sir Mart in your life. Feast your eyes and digest. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Uh, oh my goodness, you didn't say anything. When you look at this power of the water, when you look at this blueness of this beautiful, beautiful deep and why see you just want immediately to go and jump in it because it's amazing it is indeed look at that and we all understand that there's a few things for sure in downtown Paphos. that sky it's looking blue that sea it's looking blue mr paul he's dressed head to toe in blue that must mean one thing all that is missing is it's you of course you of course you so get yourself on the big bird or we can know and start paddling towards us. That's because we all impatiently waiting just for you. We are indeed. Come with us as we take you and show you some of the spectacality of the Kenopathos Harbour area. And remember, we're only in the third week of February, and it really is a spectacality of a day indeed. Big shout out to some superstars in downtown Cornwall. If your name is Duke Phil and there's a girl in your life called Duchess Sharon, all the way from downtown, is it Carfilly? No, it's not Carfilly. Is it Cain? No, it's Cornwall. All the way from downtown in Cornwall. Thank you for checking out the legalities and, well, what? 
the legalities of the word spectacality because many many people have told me that I talk absolute gibberish which I do and of course most of the time I reinvent words that do not exist but apparently according to Duke Phil spectacality is a word and it means phenomenal spectacality yeah. means phenomenal well so it's a phenomena phenomena yeah all right which is I knew that you're quite well educated uh, as like you are quite well dressed all the time who could doubt about your education and level of knowledge nobody well my level of education is not very good and the knowledge well not very good at all but anyway one thing's for sure we do know the odd thing or two about downtown kid of Paphos because if you're new to the channel we do spend an awful lot of time in this area this is where you can launch your very own boat so perhaps if your name is sir sean and there's a girl in your life called lady justine perhaps you could bring your super yacht and dock it in downtown Paphos and perhaps give a lift to those other superstars from in downtown Wiltshire of course Sir Richard his blonde beauty the lady Julie Nash and of course if they're coming along that must mean that Viscount Leo is coming as well well we had a spectacular time with this all lovely people and I would love to say you a huge thank you for making a lovely company with us for making our days and evenings that a little bit brighter and we really really will be missing you and hoping that you will be arriving very soon to us uh, would it be a paddling or getting a bird it doesn't really matter we would always waiting for you right here anywhere you want we can go just to please your heart and make your days and evenings a bit more brighter like you did to us. Thank you very much for everything. Yes, indeed. Or oh, sail in on that super yacht belonging to Sir Sean. This is the downtown Kedapapos Harbour. We've got ice cream parlours, we've got restaurants, we've got bars. And on top of all of that, we've got some spectacality of things as well. Coming up on the left-hand side, by the way, is the toilets in the harbour. And next door to that is this rather nice building, Oldie World's, all been renovated. And that is the current place where you're going to find the arts and the crafts in downtown Paphos. That's it. If you want to pop in there there's lots of things in there pumpkin girls in there there's also a girl who likes to drink on a coffee and have a cigarette and she also is the greatest handcrafted jewelry girl in the world so that's where you might want to go and get that special special gift downtown Kedapapas Harbour and that is the arts and the craft centre and as you understand everyone in there speaks pretty good English so perhaps if there's something you want made unique have a whisper in their ears and I'm pretty sure that that special item will be coming very very soon indeed. You see every time we went into that craft shop you're always finding out the new things, the new stuff, the new working art because these girls are working like a bees and I understand it takes them a huge amount of effort uh, and the fantasy of them don't have any limit by the way and they do all the best of the best in order to provide that little bit new stuff to your attention yes indeed and of course if your name is lady oh, oh so so sweet caroline you popped in there a while back and of course treated yourself to how should we say it a pumpkin that was on a droop shall we say well uh, it was our favorite size uh, don't go into there mr paul because i remember before you chose it our darling caroline i remember that i taught it it was right an excellent size so it was a good size was it what about the circumference and the circumference no doubt it was the best it was the best indeed and of course if your name's lady tracy well the girl that gave us the bow and the salute, who is the girl that makes all the handmade jewellery, by the way, you know that you popped in there and bought, well, her big boy, that's for sure, the most expensive necklace that she's ever made. 
and it is a superstar of a necklace. Don't forget to bring it with you to downtown Kenapapos because we are going to get you to wear it with that rather nice frock and you're going to become a princess and you never know, you might be dancing and prancing in one of these little steel structures in the downtown Kenapapos harbour. And again, these have come in for an awful lot of criticism but you can probably hear there's works going on in the building to the rear. That is going to be the brand new biggest restaurant on the block. It's going to be called the ocean basket those of you familiar with Paphos and cyprus understand that it's a nationwide train train no chain and of course these metal boxes are going to be outside eating whining and dining areas waiting especially for you uh, do you know to be honest uh, before they opened these both uh, sides of each container should i say it wasn't uh, that very good looking you know why? Because it was uh, locking all the views, what you could see from there to there and other way around. But now they are looking much more interesting as an idea and of course they are going to be very useful for that very plan that this place has got. Yes indeed. When they first constructed them, if you go hunting back in our videos, I understand some of the criticism because they had rears closed in and sides closed in as well but now they have removed the sides and removed the rears so it's very very minimalist and of course you've got views back towards the oldie world building there's a bit of works to do don't get me wrong but of course while you are sitting here and whining and dining with your friends and family you get to feast your eyes and to digest that which of course is the beauty and the spectacality of the downtown Kedo Paphos Harbour and what better place to be. Wow. And I really believe that this is gonna be a very unusual and unique place for this harbour area and the view to dive for. Yes, indeed. Come with us as we take you and show you one or two more of the restaurants in downtown Kedo Paphos. And of course, if you're new to the channel, we'd like to thank you for joining us. Why not hit that like why not hit that subscribe button it doesn't cost you a single penny by the way but of course if you'd like to keep us motivated to make these little videos just for you why not go and hunt us down on the buy me a coffee platform that's where you can gift us that virtual coffee or two as a thank you as a gesture of goodwill and we thank you from the bottom of our two hearts talking about these old restaurants we are feeling as i said before like mom and dad of this place it's because we all, we know every little stone under our feet. We know every little corner uh, what is coming the next. And we know every single person who is working in this lovely area. Well, we know most of them. We know the chef on the block. He's over here and he hangs out outside Stevie's. He's a very, very popular guy. And he actually gets dressed up at Christmas as Santa Claus and does a very, very good impersonation. And he gives you a big, big thumbs up. And Ochin Grisivi out of Booth does like to pose with him now and again. As usual. Well, he's a very nice um, stature or person, personization, right? To to be filmed and to be in camera. Um, he's quite a big man, not that tall as I am, but hey, this is not uh -oh. very important. What have you found there? Some hole. Some hole. <laughs> Could be a manhole. There we go. We're in the downtown Kedapapas Harbour. We're in the main event, which is the restaurants area. That's the Marine Police building there. Perhaps you should stay away from then, but not this place, because this is Stevie's, and the man in charge, the most famous man in the world, is that man there. His name is Henry. Ooh, la la, la la, la la, la la, la la, la la. How are you doing, ooh la la? This is boss lady, and the man behind the camera is the boss man. And we must say, by the way, your hat now, yeah. it's got that je ne sais quoi. Uh, hopefully. It goes with the ooh, la 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 yes, la la. Guess what somebody said to me? Uh, he walked past, the lady, he walked past me, he said, on the YouTube channel, you, I was told you change your hat, can I see it? <laughs> there we go. Henry Ulala, the most famous man in the world, especially in the Paphos Harbour. He's the man in charge of Stevie's. If you want a great meal, a great drink and great laughs, that's where you come. Always in a good mood. The man uh, who knows his possibilities, chances, is not that a drugger. He will not 
press on you is uh, doing his job in a very gentle way I would say is the best but now and again he does drag you in by the way now this over here is the biggest restaurant at the moment on the block this is the guy in charge he's got a nice white hat I think he may have stolen that from Henry Ulala Yasu you're right welcome you're right yeah, Musa, nice are you open you. now and ready for the spring season we are ready we are yes. over, over ready Uber ready Uber ready and my god look how Thank smart you. they look Thank look at that much. look at these new uniforms Thank wow you. absolutely spectacular great smile great personality sale at the castle could be the best restaurant oh, in the world right. number one there we are. Come and try it out and check it out for yourself because there's gangster number one and he's busy, busy, busy. You see? They're busy today. And just over yonder is George. Does everyone remember George? There he is. George has been in the harbour longer than the harbour has been here. Let's go and say to him, Yasu Kumbaru. Welcome back. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Are you ready for a busy Another season? Year on my back. Another year. One more year, yes. One more year. Did you have a good holiday? Of course. Yes. And now you're excited. I've been to Chris three weeks after this. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Was the weather good? Nice tavern. Good winners. Have a great time. Nice guy. Yeah. Yeah. Have a great time. I'm happy. It sounds good. Perhaps sounds don't get on a big bird. <laughs> yeah. Perhaps don't come down here. Go to Greece. I miss my wife. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell his wife. Anyway, he had a great, great holiday. There's no doubt about that. So perhaps you shouldn't come to Papos. Go and see Greece. Proceeding. Are you Greece. getting hot? I'm getting really hot, honestly. But he was joking about... Um, I know that, that the time that he spent nicely was correct and true. But he's single man. He's not married man. And we he know. said, well, I'm scared of my wife. Something like that. To be funny again. Yes, indeed. We're outside the Gilalamo. Could be the best bistro in the world. And it just happens to be in the downtown Kid of Papos Harbour. There it is. If you want a great ice cream, a great drink, that's where you go. But if you want to sit on top of the blueness of the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea, that's where you go. And if you want to see the most handsome man in the world, Mr. Emmanuel, here he is. Yasu, you all right? Good. Good. Busy? Ish. Of course, busy ish. And we've got Jackie Chan. You all right, Jack? Yes. Are you ready for that season? Yeah, you in a good mood? Are we having some dancing? Here we go. Come on, let's entice him. Come on, dance. Dance, Jackie Chan. Come on, come on. He's going to chuck him out into the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. He's worried about him stealing his thunder because that's the most handsome man in the world. Next one on the block is not open today, but guess what? It's going to reboot and open up tomorrow. And it's our favourite, favourite restaurant it's that one there. It's the Pelican Restaurant. And I'll tell you what, we've got a surprise coming for you very, very soon. So don't forget to keep coming back because when that restaurant reboots up, there's something special going to happen. And of course, they are doing a bit of painting and reorganizing. And the Pelican Restaurant is going to come back better than it ever did before. But like I've told you, there is something special coming. And perhaps the clue is in the name of the restaurant. Priscilla Booth? Do you know that we're really, really missing it. Uh, it's been quite long time since last year, by the way, because one year changed another year, and we all understand that the staff, the boss, and all the management of this uh, lovely restaurant needs to be charged the, the batteries quite well in order to be able to start the new and pressful and very beautiful season um, again and we all understand that they will charge these batteries and come back with a new power they will indeed and that's one of the superstars from the kitchen by the way and he's moonlighting as a painter and decorator making sure that the pelican restaurant comes back that little bit better especially for you and there's works going on at this one which is Theo's restaurant which is rumoured to be the busiest restaurant but don't tell the pelican and don't tell Mr Andreas the man who's in charge but it is a very very busy restaurant and they do great great food and they are going to be rebooting up this weekend so don't forget to keep coming back to the little channel known as Marika and me and next door to that is King's restaurant one of the oldest traditional tavernas in the whole of Paphos and that will be rebooting up very 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 soon indeed and of course we're looking back 
to the return of the king in charge, Mr. Harris, and of course the prince, Andreas, and the princess, Xavia. Xavia? Oh my goodness, do you know how I feel? I feel like somebody chucked me, chucked, chopped me. Chopped you? No, chopped my, uh, no. Again, confused. Get your English correct. Chucked me to the <laughs> oven. Yes. That oven uh, was about 360, maybe 400 degrees of Celsius. And I'm cooking there and I'm boiling there and I'm doing all this. Uh, taking off my clothes yeah strip tease with massage and grassy booth is coming very very soon indeed and of course on that note of ovens and cypress it always reminds me of superstar that's coming to Paphos very very soon indeed her name is lady emma there's a man in her life called lord rob there's a couple of superstars as well viscount bradley and of course princess mia yeah, and yes. they're coming to Paphos very, very soon indeed. And it always tickled me when I read one of her posts on YouTube. She goes into the kitchen, she puts the oven on and lets it warm up for around about 20 minutes. Then she goes in, opens the oven door and lets all that heat cook her. And it always reminds her of Cyprus. And I'll always remember that story for the rest of my life. And now and again, we'll chuck it into the little channel known as Marie Karamni. You know, I would say all we read all we can observe from your side it's amazing all the suggestions all the sentences whatever you providing from your best heart is a really appreciated thing and we really know that one day we all meet uh, with or without our will because sometimes you can meet without any planning to us and sometimes we can meet with a planning and with um, dates, dating, 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 only animals do it, these datings. Oh my God, where I'm gone again, somewhere wrong, uh, wrong step, you have to get me out of that line. Anyway, I would like, oh, you know, it's all my English, it doesn't matter, but I would like to say to you that it's an amazing day, a beautiful, beautiful uh, hangover. <laughs> well, after that spectacularity of an evening with Lady Julie Nash this and Lady Justine. This is hangover. Uh, in my understanding, hangover is just you hanging over these clouds and the beautiful uh, atmosphere around. And we would like to tell you that please, please don't forget to come and see another of our madness. Yes, indeed. We're loving and kissing you from the bottom of our two hearts and still here for you to make all our best in order to bring to your screens a beauty a little bit of positivity and fun yes indeed and to leave you with the spectacularity of a view indeed out into the blueness of the blue 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 mediterranean sea thanks for watching and of course we'll see you again very very soon indeed somewhere in and around Paphos in particular in the downtown get it Paphos promenade and harbour area there she is dancing on a wall doing something with the rear end especially for Mr Neils and of course hopefully she's not going to fall in otherwise Sir John Ricey will be well having his heart in his mouth it's thanks for watching I, I jumped this side but not that. not that side thanks for watching see you again very very soon Indeed.